Hey everyone, James here again. Let's talk about music promotion in a realistic way. Because all too often, I see people promoting ways to get your music out there and get it in front of people that cost hundreds or even thousands of dollars. So today, we're gonna do something different. I'm gonna give you four tools that you can start using today that will cost you absolutely nothing, but are guaranteed to help boost engagement, expand your reach, and give you more exciting visuals to help promote your music. You may have a really good song, ready to go, ready to share with the world that has the potential to change lives. But if you don't have really good visuals and images to help promote that song, it may never go anywhere. After all, we are visual people. We love to see exciting images. We love to see great music videos, lyric videos, and so forth. But making those things traditionally has been fairly difficult. You needed to study Adobe programs, or you needed to know a graphic designer that was willing to work on a very tight budget. But these days, the technology is so advanced and so smart and simple in its design that anyone can pick it up as long as they have access to the right tools. And one tool that you need to have in your toolkit is called DaVinci Resolve. It is a free video editor that is incredibly powerful. Many people would compare it to Adobe Premiere. In fact, it's used with movies and television shows all over the world to create content that is watched by millions of people. And you can have that same powerful toolkit for free right now. And this is a great platform to make things like Instagram story clips, Instagram videos, Twitter videos, TikToks, YouTube clips, music videos, visualizers, lyric videos, anything that you want to make video-wise, you can do with DaVinci Resolve and it will look incredibly, incredibly good. And it's also, as I said earlier, very simple to use. And if you ever get stuck, there are a ton of tutorials available online. So head to the description below and grab DaVinci Resolve. It's one of the four that I wanna highlight and it might be the most important. The second absolutely free service that you should be taking advantage of is Canva. Now I know some designers hate on Canva because they have thousands and thousands of pre-made templates that some people don't really customize too much before putting out into the world. But for beginners, people that don't have a lot of graphic design experience or don't know a graphic designer, Canva is an incredibly powerful tool that allows you to upload as many images as you want and create really eye-catching graphics. And they have a lot of pre-made templates that fit the size of pretty much anything you could need online. Facebook cover photos, Twitter cover photos, YouTube thumbnails, YouTube avatar icons, in fact, avatar icons for every single platform and so much more. If you wanna design a gig poster, you can do it here. If you wanna design stuff for Instagram or other social media platforms, you can do it here. You can work with templates, you can work with their gigantic image like library, or you can upload your own stuff. They have thousands of fonts to choose from, tons of fun filters, and again, it's absolutely free. Of course, there is a premium version of it that unlocks a lot more images and things along those lines, but there is more than enough free content available without spending a dime that will up the look and quality of your visuals in an instant. You do not have to have any graphic design experience to make something that looks really, really good with Canva. So absolutely sign up right away. And again, there's a link in the description below. And that brings us to the third thing, which kind of answers a question that you will inevitably come to, which is I've already created a great video or a great still image, and I'm ready to share it with my social media audience, but I need some hashtags to make it really stand out. Because if you've been on Instagram for even a day, you've realized that using hashtag music or hashtag rock and roll probably isn't going to get a lot of return for you because so many people are using those hashtags that your content's just gonna get lost in the shuffle. But there's a tool for that. There's a website called displaypurposes.com. And again, there's a link in the description below. And this website serves one purpose, which it does incredibly well. And that is to recommend hashtags that are relevant to the content that you're trying to share. So you no longer have to worry about getting lost in the shuffle of an overused generic hashtag. Display Purposes will give you suggestions that will help you narrow down your audience and find hashtags relevant to what you're trying to post that are likely to build engagement for your content. And as we move forward with social media, as more and more people use these apps more and more frequently, hashtags matter. So use display purposes to find relevant hashtags that will help broaden your audience while keeping it specific to what you're trying to promote. Now that you have free video tools, 
free still image tools, and a great tool for generating hashtags, it's time to put that content out into the world. But if you're anything like me, you often find yourself feeling pretty overwhelmed by social media. I mean, it's hard to constantly be posting on Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook, flipping between all these apps, looking at the comments, trying to engage, and trying to build awareness all at the same time. That's where Later comes in, L-A-T-E-R. Later is a free social media scheduling tool that will allow you to schedule up to a month in advance posts on virtually every major platform. So you can schedule 30 Instagram posts, 50 tweets, and more, all using the free tier on Later's social media scheduling tool. And what I love about that is that once you get a bunch of content built up, you can schedule it all, then sit back, relax, and do what you love to do the most, which is engage with your fans. You're not worried about waking up every day and making sure you have a post ready to go because it's already scheduled. You can just spend one or two days or even a week building up a batch of content, get it all into later, and then focus on the engagement part, about interacting with your fans, building your community, and just letting people know that you're out there in the world. It's a big stress reliever, greatly reduces your anxiety, and it simplifies your workflow. And again, best of all, it's absolutely free. Now obviously there are more free tools out there that musicians should be taking advantage of. One that comes to mind right away is Grammarly, which is a great tool for checking your writing and making sure you don't have any glaring grammatical errors. There are premium tiers as well, but the free one will do just fine to get you started. And I plan to make more videos about this kind of content in the near future. But as we're starting off a new year and you're really trying to focus your marketing efforts in 2021, these four tools, DaVinci Resolve, Canva, display purposes, and later will simplify your workflow and make better content for your audience so you can do what you love to do most, which is engage with your fans. If you want to have even more recommendations, please click the subscribe button down below. Music Biz exists to help you navigate this industry and I will be your guide every step of the way. And if you've already done so, then you have my greatest thanks. You make my job possible and I'll leave you with this. If you do nothing else, please take care of yourself because you deserve it.